Augustus and His Smile by Catherine Rayner. Augustus the tiger was sad. He had lost his smile. So he did a huge tigery stretch and set off to find it. First he crept under a cluster of bushes. He found a small shiny beetle, but he couldn't see his smile. And he climbed to the tops of the tallest trees. He found birds that chirped and called, but he couldn't find his smile. Further and further, Augustus searched. He scaled the crests of the highest mountains where the snow clouds swirled, making frost patterns in the freezing air. He swam to the bottom of the deepest oceans and splished and splashed with shoals of tiny, shiny fish. He pranced and paraded through the largest desert, making shadow shapes in the sun. Augustus padded further and further through shifting sand until... Pitter, patter, pitter, patter, drip, drop, plop. Augustus danced and raced as raindrops bounced and flew. He splashed through puddles, bigger and deeper. He raced towards a huge silver blue puddle and saw there under his nose his smile. And Augustus realised that his smile would be there whenever he was happy. He only had to swim with the fish or dance in the puddles or climb the mountains and look at the world, for happiness was everywhere around him. Augustus was so pleased that he hopped and skipped and jumped away, smiling. <laughs>